Montana State men's basketball hosted a New Year's party of their own Saturday, welcoming in Eastern Washington two programs that have no love lost with their last two meetings being determined by only a combined six points. And Saturday's game was no different with 16 lead changes, a game that was only determined in the last 20 seconds. In the first half, Bobcat started out strong inside the paint with Jabril Bello sealing his man for a layup off the glass. Great Osabar followed later with some post work of his own, but Saturday was all about going shot for shot, and that was from three early on with Tyrese Davis sinking it in from up top. Eastern Washington would nail three more of those to build as much as a nine point lead. However, it was the Bobcats who stole the momentum into the half first off the steal that led to this up and under from Caleb Fuller. And then with a minute to go, a huge block by Sam Lekalot. Darius Brown, the second, is there and goes coast to coast, finishing with contact at the rim to close out the half. Cats chasing five. Montana State would open up the second on an eight and two run, but the real fun didn't start until the final minute. Down by two, Steele ventures with the ball in the corner, drives inside, and steps back for the jump. Jumper tying the game at 65. Eagles call a timeout on their next possession, and just like they drew it up, it's Venters from three for the lead. Montana State quickly answered with this deep shot down court to battle to cut the lead to one, leaving just four seconds left on the clock. Bobcats foul to get the Eagles to the line, and on the missed free throw, they've got one more shot from three to send this game into overtime, but it's no good. Eagles win by three, 70 to 67. In Bozeman, Ashley Washburn, MTN Sports.